<laughs> I'm currently waiting on a flight. Last minute plans and surprises. Oh, the lady almost fell. Wow. Damn. Old me would have laughed, but you know. I'm with Flo. She's sleeping, so I'm just going to show a piece of her. We've not slept since yesterday morning. It is currently now 4.42. And yeah, I'm being a little quiet because, you know, it's, I'm trying to be a little bit discreet. So we'll catch up when I get sorted out. Hey, guys. So we can now talk a little bit more formally. I am now in Atlanta. Waiting on my connecting flight. Today is one of the exciting days because I'm going home and it's a big surprise um, to my friends. The purpose for going home already had my Trinidad flight and everything booked. Um, and I just recently started my master's in chemistry and so it was a lot of moving parts but since everything was booked I decided to still go even if I told my friends that I sold everything I went as far as putting it on my Instagram story that I was selling my costume and my tickets and you know it was a whole big thing but um, so little did they know that I'm going to be surprising them on the airport today is Tuesday um, February 14th, happy Valentine's Day. No Valentine, but it will be moved. Uh, my Valentine will be found in Trinidad and it is going to be for next year. Yeah. But today is one of the, 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 is Tuesday and then we fly to Trinidad on Thursday. And so hopefully I can keep it on the DL. Um, I, I think I, I sold them a pretty good story. And so I think they're going to be very surprised when I pull up on their asses on the airport. Trinidad is going to be very, very fun. I can't wait to experience this with them, some of them for their first time, and some others we've been to Trinidad together before, and it's always been a great vibe. So I can't wait, and I've been through a whole lot in the last month, and so I think I deserve a little bit of a, you know, treat and a, you know, let go, a release of the mind, so... I'm looking forward to that. Um, our flight is in about two hours. We have a two-hour layover, very short. Um, not even two hours, like like an hour and something. And so the first person I'm going to be surprising is Pedals. She doesn't know. She's picking us up on the airport, but she doesn't know. Um, Kareem is supposed to be on the airport picking up somebody else, so I hope I don't see him there. It's just, you know, someone she's way too small. Hopefully I don't run into anybody and I can stay, you know, hidden until Thursday but I'll be taking you along you know with the surprises and the entire journey this will be like the introduction to the Trinidad Carnival vlog for 2023 stay tuned <laughs> And then she hesitated and then she said, Yeah, he's not coming. <laughs> I'm waiting for Benny <laughs> Melly. He's not connecting. I I heard the hesitation. I said, whatever. He was <laughs> okay, good morning, my people. Good morning. It is officially now carnival time. Trinidad Carnival time. Today is Thursday, February 16th. I think 16th yes I got in to St. Lucia on the 14th of February that's Tuesday and got everything that I needed to get sorted out got me a little fresh haircut then get back to myself because that that winter hair was not it um, but today is going to be the flight day we have a little bit of a dilemma where our Airbnb's check-in time is 3 p.m. we land in Trinidad at 1 p.m. we have an event for like 2 3 p.m. and so we ended up having to, well, long story short, we're going to be changing on the airport. So we've ironed everything. Um, and so we're going to have to be doing a quick um, Jimmy Flicks on the airport to change and to go. And the first event is Beach House. So, you know, we're going to be in our, you know, Sunday's bed. Second dilemma, my friends still don't know I'm here. So that's going to be a fun thing. I, it was supposed to be like a little joke, white lie. 
you know, haha, I'm coming anyway. But they kind of pushed my hand, so I kind of had to continue lying, and then like it just became like addictive. This is my checked in piece. Um, we got packing cubes, um, and the packing cubes kind of help with separating what you need. It makes you kind of pack a little bit more because you have everything organized, so your bags end up being heavier. But you know, at least if everything in here busts, like the skincare stuff then we wouldn't have a leakage problem over into my clothes and I also have like this um, suction bag for all my other later outfits um, so these things I don't need immediately except this bag but I can't travel with it in my carry-on so let's go to the carry-on so as some of you may know from 2020 I suffered a great loss when my bag got left in Tenusha so I did not have any clothes until the following day's evening right so this is not going to happen again my carry-on is going to have what I'm having for beach house and for the next two events, shoes, brush, toothpaste, everything that I need for the next three days. So Caribbean Airlines could fuck time if they want. I'm just joking, they not cannot fuck time at all. I need my bags. <laughs> The first victim. <laughs> So we finally land in Trinidad. We have half of the crew, Ian, which side I went, Ofla, and Kareem. And the Kiba from 2020's vlog is back. You know, we have the loyalty. <laughs> <laughs> so we're on our way. We had to change in the airport because, you know, time and then the check in, like I said this morning, the check in for our hotel was 3 o'clock, so that just wouldn't work. So we're on our way to the e event now. First event is Beach House.
So what, what you took up the two points for? Mm, entertainment. Yeah. I, you see, I think I'm a DJ type of person. You see, from the yeah. time that people start to sing, yeah, you can keep that. Yeah, exactly. Kareem, 10 out of 10? Mm, I give it a... I, I had fun. Yeah, I had Drink fun. Drink was good, food was good. Yeah. They made for me, I like entertainment. I like live entertainment. entertainment. So for me, it was good. Yeah. But she was good. I enjoyed was it. Was she? Yeah. For me, uh, yeah, I'm, a, I'm a fan of Patrice. Yeah, nice. So I will always like it. Okay. okay. <laughs> oh gosh, she's sweet. <laughs> oh. <laughs> she dressed and did her makeup. Yeah. So it, it was good. You liked it. It was nice. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so guys, I'm a little drunk, but I'm not going to lie to you. We're now bringing our bags because we went straight to the event from the airport, as you can see in the vlog earlier. And so this is where we are now bringing our bag. We're going to check it in. It's crazy. Why is the bag on the floor? This is a mess. No, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 wait, wait. Open, open, open. Oh, bye. Good morning guys, it is a new day, it is Friday, Carnival Friday in Trinidad and Tobago and um, this is the view on the balcony, everybody's, you know, it's chaos in the back there, you know, over there and so we're now going to Silent Morning, it's a boat cruise, it's on the Harbour Master, luckily I think the Harbour Master is not as far as it used to be, I don't think any of the parties that we're going to this year is all the way down in Shagaramas, which is there as everybody should know the end of the island, one way in, one way out, traffic is insane. So, our drivers are here and we're just trying to do finishing touches. Buenos dias, como Karim. Hola. Ian. Miss Fleur. Hi. The princess. Getting beautified. Putting on earrings. Say good morning. Good morning. <laughs> now we're about to leave. Um, guys, it's two minutes. We got two minutes! Two minutes! So hard keeping these people in check, you know.
team we don't really waste time You come back or you know a real vibe You wanna taste this one more time Girl let me start it So call out the bridal party We gon' make all the residents happy Bartender make it snappy Put the queen in front the king like Wabi On the road like whoa oh oh Yeah 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 Run it next time Like yourself Like yourself Like it Everybody just switch on Okay guys, so we're just leaving Silent Morning. I'm losing my voice. We're going to collect our costumes. So we're just giving you a little recap of what you just saw in the vlog. The, 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 boat, the boat ride was... <laughs> the boat ride was very good. Silent Morning is always a vibe for me. Um, I like that it was overcast today, so it wasn't scorching. So it was very nice upstairs. The vibes were nice. The trips was flowing. They had more food than me did, than we even knew they had. I just, you know, I have I took cupcakes to go in my cup, but it's okay. You know, you just warm it up with some tea, and that's my breakfast for tomorrow. <laughs> okay. How was it, guys? Started up slow, but ended up amazing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Ten agree. out of ten. Recommend. Yeah, it was super good. Actually, certain one is always the highlight of my trip. Yeah, because it's always really good. It's really good. That's it's really true. a good boat ride. So, guys, if you come to Trinidad next year, Saturday morning is a must. And the cupcakes are actually good. Kisha said she didn't want it, but. Who's Kisha? Kisha. Our driver. Oh, no, no. Yeah, yeah. Why do you call me Kisha? The kids are getting ready to go see Marshall Nigerian Prince. Okay, yes. Which one like of the Nigerian? I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to have a wedding for sure. <laughs> sure. Like, sure. But it's the fit. Very nice. How was Marshall? You they didn't even see Marshall, they only see Marshall. Right? I really like that. You know, look the, look the, the thing on Freddy. Okay. We're on our way to Susan yeah. Ambush. It's now three o'clock. Um, everybody, we just met up as a group, so half half, you know, I'd have to say, you're just doing are you. But we meet up half half. <laughs> oh, yeah. So her. Yeah, the All the right. event is the same place as last year. It's a racetrack. I'm not really fond of the track because it's not bush, but you know I'm still going to go. So we're gonna have a good time. The They're dressed side. already. They're dressed already. Karim is eh, eh. this is Karim enjoying his life. Ready for ambush. Okay. We are pegging behind truck number three with yeah, HP for him to play all the booyo. All the Dominican you ready, booyo. You push your hand in your mm, and push it in my mouth. Wow. Wow. That's what I'm ready that is for. The coffee people, the old men. It's good? You feeling good? That's what you needed? Yes, it's good. What you say, Karim? Let's pick her up. It's sweet. That is what I have. Karim, I think you I find you a little flat, so you have to go a little higher. Yeah. It's sweet! It's sweet! No, that's too high. That's too high. It's sweet. Uh-huh. Oh gosh, it's sweet. I, I, so oh, it, it, yeah, it needs to be. Oh, gosh, it's sweet. But to me, that's not high. Yeah. That's high. It's higher than you. Oh, gosh, it's sweet. It's sweet. In the water. Duck. 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 In the water. Duck. 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 In the water. Duck. 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 In the water. Duck. Duck. Duck, 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 in the water, 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 in the
Tea. It was good, it was scary, you know, people throwing things on me, I had to get used to that. Yeah, because you, you're you accustomed to swinging, right? You know what? <laughs> <laughs> I generally just like to be at an event and just look pretty, but this one, you know, mm -hmm. everybody dirty and just having fun, so it was an adjustment, but it was good. I liked the foam because I felt like when I was too dirty, I could clean up myself. Right. You know, I was running from a lot of people who just had the mission of getting me dirty. Right, right, right. But you know, it was it was fun. <laughs> now, next time, I just have to figure out what I'm going to do with my hair because I can't have all the plastic bags and that's why in the house, that's not possible. Yeah. So I have to figure that out and then we're good, you know? Right. You're on candy camera. How was the event this morning? Oh, it was amazing. Yeah, I feel like all the events this year have been eating, right? So far. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Um, What what can I say? Except for one person who called. Um, paint in my air and he was upset that I pushed him because why the fuck are you doing that? Oh, I got paint in my eye. Did they tell you? <laughs> no. yeah, when I went in the foam pit, I just saw green in my eye and I was I started freaking out trying to wash it. Um, yeah, but it was an experience. And now we're heading to Soka Brainwash. Mm -hmm. I chose a dress where I don't need pants. Well, that doesn't make sense. And that gives nude it though. Sense, eh? It's nude though. It gives nude, okay? And it, it gives, gives the theme of dream. Because mm -hmm. um, they did dream in Miami. When mm -hmm. I did Miami, um, Soka Brainwash, mm -hmm. the theme was dream. And I did that one. So this is a play on it. I also had a black dress then. It was a mini dress. But this one, I'm wearing. And we'll see when she's finished. Hey okay, guys, um, we are done getting ready for, well, first of all, Taking the paint off from Juve, um, Scissors Army. Ambush it wasn't hard, as hard this year because we barely got dirty with powder, which is the worst. It, uh, it stains your skin really badly. Um, we had like more of the watery paint, which was great. It gave the effect that it needed to give, but it was also, you know, water soluble. So we got that off kind of easily and I used my um, cleansing balm. I'm going to post a reel on Instagram and on TikTok at OG Vibe showing you how I got the paint out from my hair and from the rest of my face. So go check that out. Also, as you can see from the top part of it, it's a nude theme. Well it's 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 one of the themes one of the dress codes could be nude. And so I think the majority of people are going to be wearing nude because the other um the other guidelines were a little confusing. So I think a lot of people are going to be in nude or white. Um, for the heaven theme um, Yeah, so I have a you know all nude number and you have to go to my Instagram as well to see the full fit Okay, I'll show you, just, you know, just a little bit, right? All nude period. We also have to go collect our costumes at the mass camp because tell me why I don't know why Yuma Decided that they're gonna close their distribution center number two on a Friday, which is one of the busiest days for people collecting costumes. I mean, just in the history of collecting costumes, right? People usually do it on Friday. Um, so yeah, we have a problem with that. So we have to go today. In between, we had to like add a stop with our driver to get that done before we could get into Soka Brainwash. Hey guys. Hi. 
with big flag going over them like canopy. When you're in a house, <laughs> when you're in a house full of people, you have to make it do what it do. Just getting ready. This is your chick. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> <I cried. laughs> this is a co ed house. Ready or what? Hey. Getting ready for Carnival Monday. Getting ready. Are you excited? Excited. Ready to go. Facts. Green is showering. Mm -hmm. So hey guys, it's Carnival Monday. I did not close out the Soka Brainwash vlog. Um, yeah, but we had collection that day from Yuma. If you go on my page, you'll see the unboxing for the goodie bag, which I just filmed, so it should be up today. Um, distribution was okay. It started off really well, and then I had to wait a little bit longer than expected for um, the second and third costumes that I had to be collecting. Um, I think if you're doing like partnerships between brands and bands you should like kind of streamline it i don't have to, if i'm collecting a crave costume and i'm collecting a yuma costume i shouldn't have to feel like i'm collecting two separate costumes from two separate bands so that's the only thing but um after that we went to soka brainwash and had a blast it was extremely hot but we still had a good time once the sun kind of simmered down a little bit um soka brainwash is always going to be a staple it's always going to be one of the most fantastic parades festivals out ever so no complaints there um yesterday was kind of a relaxed day um the three of our three guys went to a party last night well anyway it's another show but today we're getting ready um we have about half an hour to leave the house yuma is starting at 10 today it's 9 30 now i'm still looking for my voice have not found it yet um and yeah we're gonna make it do what it do i'm trying to use my same shoe from Caesar's Army because the other shoes and my feet are just not cooperating. My foot has had enough for the season. So yeah, I'm just about to go apply some sunscreen and um, have a whole sunscreen video that I'm going to upload on Instagram at OG Vibe and on TikTok at OG Vibe. So just subscribe to those stuff so you can see everything. I mean, I might have some information, some content here, some over there, which does not cross over. So just make sure you follow me on everything so that you know you never miss any of the good vibes. Um, I'm going to check in with you guys when we're about to leave, show you the Monday way fits. Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so guys, this is the D Junction app. It is like a carnival band app that shows you the location of all the bands where it is in Port of Spain so if you're lost you can find your band it's very helpful like especially at the start of carnival where they tell you to meet at a certain point and you really are late like we are kind of right so it looks like this oh they did a little upgrade but you do band locator so yeah so you can go through the list of bands here um let's see we're in Yuma be at the bottom here, you ma, you ma. right, the last one. Yeah. Yeah. Recording you live. <laughs> I don't love <laughs> Okay, so Carnival is on a pause right now because we just got into an accident. <laughs> I'm not making this up. Don't tell my mother. That's crazy. Oh, his front of his vehicle is total. Point 
Cheers. Cheers. It was great. First time on the road. You know, it was definitely a vibe. The songs were sounding and the DJs were playing. It was great, had a good time, the DJs were good, the music was amazing. The sun wasn't too hot, so I was good. Yeah, no complaints. <laughs> they went dangerous? You saw me on the road, you said before. I was in the yes. I was in serious. You tap me on my shoulder, I say, you want doubles? I say, huh? <laughs> I live in my own toilet. I see where you were, Laurie. I'm very clear. Oh my god. So, yeah, Carnival was really good today. Um, yeah. I enjoyed the road. I really, really enjoyed the, the road. The DJ Dower truck was excellent. Yeah, truck, number one. truck number one was the vibe. Um, the only thing I is when I didn't get Campari when I asked for it. Although there's branding for Campari. But, you know. I'm sure there will be tomorrow, um, and I really wasn't drinking heavy today at all. It was more about hydration, so it's whatever. Um, but yeah, we're ready to do it again tomorrow. Um, you must start at 7 a.m. It's just crazy, um, but we decided we were going to go at 8. So, ow, taking off the plasters. So yeah, time to go finish eat and rest and we will see you guys in the morning carnival tuesday everybody's in costume we're heading for the road it's nine o'clock we're supposed to be there for seven but you know Life. you know <laughs> well <laughs> um why is my food ringing That's new. anyway we're about to be on the road